All right, welcome back, everybody. We are back to play some more Silent Hill, or Silent Hill, goddamn. Resident Evil Code Veronica. All right. Come on, buddy. I'm, if I'm gonna waste all my ammo, I might as well do it now. Really? Damn, dude. Okay, great. We're in a really bad place right now. Let's pick some stuff up. Um. Yeah, I'm excited. You know, like, I'm, I'm all about, like, let franchises die. Like, I, if they never brought back Silent Hill, that would have been perfectly fine with me. What I would like is, like, some sort of, like, hey, we are finishing this. We're, 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 we're like, sunsetting it, and we're going to do something else. I think that's, like, the ideal um, thing for them to do. But if they're going to be bringing it back, then, yeah, of course, I'm going to um, check it out. Okay. Oh, this looks fun. This looks a lot like the uh, the bedroom from the mansion. Wait, what, but like the mansion in this one, the mansion on the island. All right, let's go to the other side. I think unless I can. Is this a door? This is not a door. Okay. This is a door. Is this where we came from? This is not where we came from. Let's check this out. You beat the first boss in Neo? Uh, after many, many attempts, you celebrate it like you, you beat the game, then you realize that the first boss and you had many more to go. Yep. Hey, good job. Congratulations. It only gets harder, but it also only gets easier. You'll learn more stuff. You'll get a better build, become more comfortable. And so it'll get harder, but it'll get easier. So that's awesome. Good for you. I'm trying to remember what the first boss of that game is. I've uh, man, what was the first boss? I remember it was like the third boss. I think it was like a nightmare. All right, we got a save room here. Let's go ahead and pick up a bunch of shit. There we go. Beautiful. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Yes, more of that, please. Okay. Oh man. Found the key. Sterile room key. This must be the key. The biohazard symbol is carved on it. Yep. Um, I'm glad you didn't join it, though. It's a portrait of a beautiful woman, the master of the Ashford family, Veronica. Only useless books. And these these people hate books. I don't know what it is about the Redfield family. It just absolutely hates books, but... I really need to get back into uh, Neo 2 at some point. I remember I, I think I was like streamed like the first four hours of that game. Some exec. Oh right, in the castle. Yes, I remember now. Yeah, nice. Yeah, that was a two-phase boss too, wasn't it? Like once you defeat him, you have to fight him again. All right, let's go. Hello, hi one three three seven. Welcome. Can't wait for the remake. Uh, we're talking about um, Silent Hill 2 remake. Awesome. I feel like everything's being remade. Like, we have Dead Space being remade. We have Silent Hill 2 being remade. We have Resident Evil 4 being remade. Like, some of the best horror games are just getting remade. It's cool. This is so weird. How did that, how did that happen? Oh, you beat him and his friend as the second boss. Oh. On Ryoko or something. Oh, okay, okay. I gotcha. Things are gorgeous. For instance, there's nothing useful here. Okay. Um, I just, like, when it comes to, like, Silent Hill 2, it's weird because, like, everything in that game kind of comes together. The, like, the, the you know, the shitty graphics, the, the amazing music, the bad, like, voice acting. Like, you'd think that that would make that game awful, but, like, it all works together to, like, 
build this cohesive like this is just a very strange and eerie location kind of thing the blue sapphire has been removed okay so i gotta get a blue sapphire gorgeous furnishings here but nothing useful can i go through this is a tiny bed like chris is five nine and this bed looks like it's like a like a bed for a baby Um, it's just strange how we're getting so many remakes. And then we're getting some other stuff, like Callisto Protocol. That looks exciting. I can't wait to play that. Nothing useful. Hmm. Music box is playing. Stop the music box, yes. Red Ruby has been removed. Did I? Wait, what? It was just there. Huh. Okay, I think those look like half rubies. I think this is where the uh, the, the eye of the, the lion statue, I think this is where that comes into play. So I think we know what to do now because we got the key for it. So let's go, let's go do the thing. We never, what's this? It appears to be some kind of control panel. <clears throat> Code Veronica Report. After many long years of research, I finally identified the inheritance the inheritance element that administers the intelligence of man. I even succeeded in manipulating the absolute value of intelligence artificially by recompo uh, recomposing the base alignment of the elements. I then sampled the gene of our great ancestor, manipulated its element, then impl implemented it into an unfertilized egg of a surrogate mother. This must be Alexander, and this is how he makes the twins, I bet. What I didn't expect was that twins, a boy and a girl, were born. The boy had higher intelligence than normal, but not high enough for him to be considered a genius. However, the girl had unmatched intelligence that easily allowed her to be classified as a genius. She had exactly what I had been looking for, the revival, or she was exactly what I was looking for, the revival of her great ancestor. I already determined their names. The girl's name, Alexia, and the boy's name, Alfred. I'm certain that Alexia will elevate the name of the Ashford family to extreme glory, Alexander Ashford. I love how he named her the, like, the smarter one after himself. That's very good. Uh, electronic microscope appears to be old. Oh, look at these. Good, this is what we need, is more healing stuff for sure, so... Let's pick that crap up. This will bring us down. Let's go up first. Where does this bring us to? Oh. Oh, Claire. This is where Claire is. Okay, hold on. can't open this with my hands. Oh, let's pick up some ammo. Oh, okay. Hmm. I should probably use one too, because I am in caution, but... I will. Thank you. There appears to be some kind of control panel. Okay. There's a button. Press it. Yeah. Is that a is that a blunt? That looks like a blunt. What is this? Oh, a wing. Okay. Hmm. We could heal. Or I could just combine these. I'm just gonna do that. And then we're gonna go see uh we're gonna see your girl. Claire. Still crying over Steve for some weird reason. 
since this is a Resident Evil game, I'm assuming that Steve will come back alive at least two more times before we finish this game. At least. Okay. Ooh, I wonder if I move this. Is there stuff under here again? Nope. I'm assuming this is the same here, but we're gonna... We're not gonna assume, we're gonna check. Okay. Yeah, totally. Alright. Let's go meet up with our sister again, so we can be separated in, like, a minute. Claire? Is that you, Claire? Chris? No! The door won't open! Hey, is Steve with you? Oh, uh, not now, Chris. Steve, he... He broke up with me. Listen, Claire. We have to get out of here immediately. Can you unlock it from the inside? He never blinks. No, I can't. Oh, there he is. He blunked. Chris. Chris. There should be a self-destruct system somewhere. If you activate it, all the electronic locks might be deactivated. This is true. Just <laughs> <laughs> like fucking pushes it. Oh, god damn it. Alright, hold on, Claire. I need access to a box. Um, it's US F1 weekend, so qualifying isn't until 11 p.m. Oh boy, yeah, you got a you got a long night ahead of you then. <laughs> Ooh, hold on. We can put the shotgun down. See what that does. I hope it gives us a better shotgun. That would be fun. Alright, let's put this away. Let's put that... There. Nope, I want that back. Shit. Um, this we can put here. And we're gonna hold on to it, because I think we're gonna need that here shortly. We're gonna put this away. Let's take the shotgun out. Quite what I was expecting, but we'll take it. And we'll take our shotgun back. Thank you. <laughs> Alright. Let's equip this. Let's combine this. Let's put the um the flame rounds away. We're doing pretty good with, as far as like the grenade launcher goes, you know? We have, what, 30, 42, 42 rounds of whatever, and then we have a bunch of magnum stuff. Although we do have that one box that we forgot to open that's got magnum ammo on it, so hopefully we can open that before we're, um, before we're finished here. Um... There's nowhere to save here, which is really fun. So we're gonna we're gonna safety save. All right, let's go. We're gonna blow some shit up. 
11 p.m. your time. So that's like, uh, it's just like in an hour. You got an hour. I'll keep you awake for an hour, maybe. I'll try. I don't know how you could fall asleep to like this, oh, two hours? Um, to this epic music. Uh-huh, I knew you'd get up. I knew it was gonna happen. I called that shit. Alright, well. now before it like before we open all these doors you think this thing's still smashing oh god damn it I shouldn't have let him I shouldn't have gone up there fucked up all right. let's go do the thing yes take the security file Something seems to be caught inside. Security card was among the files. Alright, here we go. Let's go state of emergency time, baby. Locks, there's a hole. Dragonfly. All right. Hopefully we didn't have to find the body. I think we did. Shit. Turn both devices simultaneously. How do we turn on the the emergency though? I thought I thought that's what this was. Oh, uh, you know what? I bet you we gotta get those jewels. Let's go get those jewels. Downstairs. Okay, I remember now. Sometimes it takes a second to interpret like what's going on on that map. It's not as clear as you'd want it to be. We gotta go out this, this way, right? Yes. Okay, here we go. Unlock this. Yep, chuck that shit. Okay, now that we can come around this way, we have to go turn off all the power. Still need to figure out something to do with this thing. Love the epic music. I feel like we should save. We still have eight. Do, 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 do. 
Causing such a headache for you this weekend. Yesterday, all the Lyft and Uber drivers were busy taking people to F1, so the prices and wait times were high. Oh, really? <laughs> are they doing? So are they doing uh, F1 down where you're at? Is that what it is? That's pretty funny. And you mean they're doing F1 by you, and you're not going? I bet you that's just loud. And the circuits. Oh wow, that's cool. How, how much was, how like, how much more expensive was it? Also, that sounds like a really good time to start Ubering. <laughs> Just do it during like events and stuff. All right, here we go. Yes, it don't matter, take it. Yes, and now it won't turn because it's got no power. There we go. Let's get the hell out of here. What am I supposed to do with you? What are you holding? Whatever that is looks really important. If one is stupid expensive, like stupid. COTA is out of the city and there's only one way in or out, so it's actually a huge pain to ask for Ubers. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty funny. Alright, I need to figure out how to tip this thing over. What if I bring it to the doorway? You think that it's, like, tall enough that it's gonna, like, tip over if I... Nah. The physics on that don't work quite right, but it's a video game, so you never know. The, um, is that where they do it? Circuit of the Austin. Friday tickets were 59, Saturday 129, and Sunday is 259. Mostly sold out, and that's just for entry. Ah, damn. Hey, good for them. They hustle, and they get paid. You see this, like, uh, the Blink 182 thing? Where people are starting to get pissed off again at Ticketmaster for once again just screwing the whole, uh, like, okay. They needed to give you like one more reason to waste a bunch of ammo. Suck a dick. <laughs> the nosebleeds were 500. Wow. So I didn't get tickets. Damn. That's brutal. Hey, you sh watching it online for free is probably the better way to watch that then. <laughs> All right. Let's do this. Put that butt in. Yeah. Open that shit up. The music box is open. It's a really good texture. <laughs> okay. What happened to the epic music? It's the music box play. Take it, yes. Damn, thank you. I'm assuming I can't go. Oh, I can. Wow. I thought that would be a one way for some weird reason. 500 bucks. God damn. 
Let's get out of here. Come on, Chris. Climb that ladder. Yeah, I bet you Chris climbs the ladder really good. Nothing useful here. Look at that babe. Is that Victoria? I think that's supposed to be Victoria, right? And look, oh, they put a slash through their father's um their father's uh picture. That's that's pretty good. Portrait of a man displayed here. Here's a man. Yeah, let's pick all this shit up because I'm definitely going to need it. If this last, last boss battle is anything like any of the other boss battles in this game, I'm pretty much, like, I'm very screwed. I'm so low on ammo. Oh, the butterfly. Okay. Or dragonfly, not butterfly. Yep. It's a dragonfly object that's missing its wings. Okay. So let's combine that with that. Then that'll give me the whole thing. Golden dragonfly object made of jewels and gold. All the wings are attached. Cool. It looks like a vape. That'd be kind of a cool vape though. Like one that's like a dragonfly. It looks like you're sucking the dragonfly's ass. That's kind of cool. If you're into that sort of thing. Is this something? Can I open this? No. Okay. What a weird room. Yeah, let's go. See, this is why I'd like to just sit at home. I save so much money just sitting here. Although I say that, but I, I just had a bunch of Warhammer shit come in. That shit was expensive. Alright. Let's get out of here. Hopefully there's not a lot of zombies out here. To rain on my parade. Oh, damn it, damn it. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Did you see that? That's next level. <laughs> oh, I should have saved. You know what? We're going to use uh, the technology of today. And, uh, there we go. This is a hybrid game. Alright, let's go. Over a thousand euro for good seats in the British. Oh my god. I mean, of course it is, right? Like, there's people that'll pay that easily. Like, there's there's super rich people that are into F1. F1's one of those sports where you have to be super rich to get into, I feel like. So, like, of course they're gonna charge a shitload of money. Why wouldn't they? Their clientele are rich. And it's actually cheap. I figured, like, record tickets this year. Wow. 1,000 seems really cheap, too. Like, for what I thought it would be. You've unlocked the door. Alright. How's it going? Frick. Oh my god. Oh. handgun ammo to get that one herb. I don't think that was worth it.
Just hoping that I have enough ammo. <laughs> There's the terminal. It's a release for the self-destruct system. Yes, here we go. You put the security card in the card slot. I always love these little interfaces they got. So good. Uh, self-destruct safety lock release system. Please enter the security code. I remember. Yes. And it's so obvious. Like... Veronica. <laughs> Come on. The security code has been confirmed. The self-destruct safety lock release system has been released. All door locks have been released in order to help expedite the evacuation process. This facility will detonate in five minutes. Oh shit, here we go. All are now Here we go! Fuck off! <laughs> oh! You made it! I did! Of course! Come on! Let's get out of here! Oh, that's a giant penis. Claire, don't look. Don't look. This is gross. You don't need to see this. Oh, hello. What she are we like, gonna do? Did she remake herself, or is, is that how she? Did she travel through a tube of like? Oh. Okay. Turn the key clockwise simultaneously on three. Got it. Okay. <laughs> oh, cool. One. Two, the count faster. Three. <laughs> Somebody go grab that thing, please. I'll keep her busy. Just go for the emergency elevator. Chris, but I can take care of this. Just. Go! You have to make it. Don't die on me. Stupid. You could both work together to kill this thing. Oh, shit. Back the fuck up, bitch. Was that it? Nope. What the fuck? Was that like an option? Like I had an option of letting Claire die there or something? Energy is being charged. Fucker's release least once charge is complete. Oh, fuck you. Alright. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, I'm about to die. I don't think I'm prepared for this fight. At the finale, it just gets tenfold bug bugs. <laughs> Oh, aim for the stupid bug! God damn it! Oh god! This is... This seems like pushing me around. Oh my god! Is it done yet? Are you done charging? Oh my god! Oh, God. Oh. 
This is what the fuck? I'm about to die. I'm about to die. the countdown timer. Jesus. All right, Fudge. Thanks for ch hanging out. Have fun with your uh, your F1 in. Have a good night. Been some Walking Dead, nice. Sense here. This shit goes. This we need. This we're definitely taking. Uh, standard grenades. Standard of those. Alright. Honestly, what I should do is take these. This, and then... Oh, man. And honestly, like, I think I should probably drop the shotgun. Because what I think I'm going to be using is that magnum. Damn, I wish I was able to get that last one opened up. Way. I might as well switch this out with this one. Put this. And then, um, let's just save this slot for. Alright, let's go. Oh, I should probably heal. I must save Claire, okay. Very declarative, like, I must. <laughs> Pretty good. Alright. We're gonna save up here, just in case this doesn't work out and I need to re... Um, uh, this one. Alright. Let's -a go. I gotta do this every time though, don't I? <laughs> Alright. Burr. Uh. Oops, 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 oops. Burr. Uh. Mm. Okay. Ah. Uh. Enter. This 
facility will detonate in five minutes. All doors are now unlocked. Just to, just in case, let's do a uh, slot two. All right, let's go. Now I guess I just have to live long enough to like. You made it. Yes, I did. Let's see what happens if we let her uh, energy recharge. Oh. oh man. Okay. So yeah. Okay. So it's not an option. It's. It's less of an option and more of a, oh, you just need to make sure this gets done. Oh, okay. An advanced weapon developed to handle BOWs. Okay, well, good thing. Good, because we. Oh, wow! Look at this! Oh, shit! Wow. This is a. Uh... Oh, come on! I think I need to like wait for it to do something. Oh man. Come on. Oh my god, this is absurd. One in a million. Amazing. <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> Chris, oh, uh, God, move. Uh, Where? No. Not Wesker. We're not done yet, I guess. Hopefully, I still have that linear launcher. Come 
on, Chris. There you go. That's my boy. Oh. Are we going back to the helipad? Chris! Well done, Chris. It turns out that Alexia's work wasn't much of anything. So now, the only thing left is revenge. Let her go, Wesker! You don't want her. Fine. Claire! Today's a good day. I came for Alexia, but killing you is even better. Sorry to disappoint you, but Alexia is gone. That's no longer a concern to me. I have Steve to work with. What? <gasps> Steve. In his body, there's still a living T. Alexia virus. Steve should be a good specimen. T. Alexia virus. Maybe he'll come back alive, just as I did, and be able to see your sister again. You freak. Don't you touch him. You freak. I'm sorry, dear heart. But my men have already taken him. You get out of here. What about? As a surviving member of Stars, I have to finish this. Remember your promise. <sighs> I'll end this once and for all. Say hello to my comrades who have killed. Oh, I don't know where you get your confidence, Chris. Oh shit. Dude, he's like Dragon Ball, dude. He can't just. Oh. Oh. Damn. Oh. I thought he would have caught it with his mouth or something. Oh my god. Come on, Chris. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate She's immediately. gonna go back. Kind of shitty how, like, this is Claire's game for the most part, right? Chris comes in during, like, the last, like, bit. But, like, during these climactic battles, Chris is just like, you go. I will take care of this. Ooh. Come on, Chris. Oh. Sure, I'm not human anymore. But just look at the power I've gained. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Magnificent. Oh. Don't you think? Get it! That was a good jump. <laughs> Right, Chris, go. Wesker will kill Chris and Claire. We'll go Super Saiyan. <laughs> Next time we meet, 
don't count on another. Next time. Until we meet again. <laughs> So bad anime, I love it. Hello, oh, time to wait for an elevator, I guess. Chris, where are you? Keep my promises. <laughs> uh, that's got to be game over, right? Chris, promise me. Please promise that you won't leave me alone again. I'm sorry, Claire, but it's not over yet. There's still something we've got to do. You mean... Yeah, it's payback time. We've got to destroy Umbrella. Now. Let's finish this once and for all! Oh. oh. We won, I guess. <laughs> oh, that's fucking hilarious. Amazing. Amazing. Clap, 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 clap. You... I wonder... I really want to know, like, where, what the, like, mind, mind frame was when it's like, we need to go more anime with this. This is not enough. We need to get more ridiculous. Oh, what a, what a silly, silly game. Holy shit, that was ridiculous. Well, there you have it. Resident Evil Code Veronica X in all its glory. That was alright. It was, there were 100% certain, like, the, the, the health and the ammo tests. Absurd. I don't know how that got passed. I want to, I want to, like, talk to, like, some developer and ask, like, wh whoever was, like, in charge of, like, making those decisions was, like, the director, I guess, right? Like, it's kind of like, where, why? How, how did you come to this conclusion that... The, you had to do these things. It's ridiculous. It's so antithetical of like what these games were to like that one part where you have to have two healing things on you and you have to be essentially at full health. Um, when like most of the time you don't even want to like I don't even want to be carrying around any health. It's so weird. What a cool game though. I, it's fun. Those cutscenes were really good. They really took advantage of the extra power the PS2 gave them and the Dreamcast, I guess. Um, was it the Dreamcast or the Saturn? I think it was the... I think this might have been a Dreamcast game. I don't remember. Whatever. Anyways. Yeah. Cool. Um, next time. Next full big game that we're going to be doing is uh, Fatal Frame 3. Uh, what time is it? Probably not today because it's already getting late. But tomorrow we will be starting Fatal Frame 3. Pretty excited to try that. Um... The first two are good. I think people seem to think the it seem to say the second one is the best one. I think I like the first one more than the second one, but I think they were both fun. Um, so I'm looking forward to three. Oh man. Um, yeah, cool. I'm glad I finally got to play that. I've been wanting to play this one for a long time, and now I can kind of see where people are coming from when they say some when I've heard like the stuff that I've heard about it. Um, but definitely cool. It's cool, like kind of seeing like the like you can see some influence of this game that I had on like four as far as like some of like the the visuals and stuff like that. Like there's it's kind of cool. What do you think Allison Court is doing right now, or better yet, what Peter Oldring or Layla Johnson's doing right now? Those were some really good, 
really good at laughs. There's Richard Wow for Wesker. Amazing. Voice director, you did a really good job. Suzaki, I think that was. I missed it. Publicity planning. Special thanks. I should be in there somewhere. <laughs> yeah, that's so strange. So it's, it's interesting how this is definitely like a full-fledged Resident Evil game. Like, this one's pretty long. But on top of that, it's also just like... It's a full-fledged Resident Evil game, but they decided they didn't want to call a mainline Resident Evil game. And I wonder why. I wonder if maybe it's kind of the change in tone, maybe. Maybe it is something to do with that tone. Maybe they're like, oh, this is a little too not in line with what we have, so we're going to make this its own separate thing. So, is this the first time Wesker comes back since the first one? I don't remember him being in 2 or 3. Oh, I never played the original 2. I don't remember him being in the original 3. And he wasn't in those, um... I don't remember him being in the remakes. So is this the big, like, Wesker return? But it does establish that he's not just a human anymore, so there's that. So yeah, we, we have to do four and the zero. I do want to do four next just because that remake's coming out. So I wanna I wanna get four done before the remake. So we'll definitely be playing it here in the next couple of months. Um I don't know when exactly, but I do wanna go through it. And then we'll have um zero to do. And then I think we'll save five, six for like next horror uh, uh what's it called Terratober. Oh, look at that. They went and did things. Fragrance outlet meets meets Powell. Oh, we got an E rank and great, great. Tw that's 13 hours. This game definitely felt like it took longer than 13 hours. E. <laughs> Battle game. Battle game! E for effort. Oh. Oh. <laughs> All right. Battle game? What? Oh. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. What's battle game? This is like mercenaries or something. Player select, Claire Redfield, 19 years old. She's a female. A type zero, she's five foot five. Combat knife, handgun, blowgun, or bowgun. Handgun bullets and herb. We got Chris, he's 25, male, type O. Oh, he's got the Magnum. Oh, oh man, we could play as Steve. Yes. Look at the ID number. ID number, like not the actual number, look at how it's spelled. Number, number, number. Um, he's 17 years old. He's a beam. He's got the golden luger though. Okay, uh, I mean, we have to play a Steve, right? Whatever this is, we have to play a Steve. This is weird. Oh my god, oh, uh, I should probably equip something in. Oh, I have infinite ammo? Oh my god. This is amazing. Oh, this is so good. This is so good, I love this. <laughs> I thought Resident Evil 7 was the first, first, like the first first person Resident Evil. I was, oh yeah, that's right. Oh boy, 
That's right, boys. Come on over. Steve's got some hot lead for you. Something hot and leady. Uh oh. <laughs> Just go. Go, Steve, go. Oh, let go of me, perv. Oh, you too. I must defeat the monster. Wait, what? I'm about to kill everybody? Okay, so you have to defeat them. The monster is the person who made this game mode. <laughs> oh, Jesus! Oh, oh, boy. Hold on. Do we have something bigger for this? Oh, my God, yes. Come on! Oh. Oh, God. Oh, he just fucking smashed his friend over him. It's great. Oh, God. We're in caution. Ah, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and use a mixed herb. Wait, what is this? What? Family picture. Oh my god. It's a picture of Steve and his parents. This is what he keeps in his pocket. This is his, his, uh, his special item. It's a picture of his parents. Ooh, let's take this. This is GTA, <laughs> GTFO Alpha. Yeah. Speaking about GTFO, we should jump back into that. They've updated that shit out of that game. This is like original GTFO. Oh, this is. What is this? Oh, damn! It's kind of cool though, like seeing this in first person. What a fun, dumb thing. I'm supposed to be going. I'm just kind of going. Oh, jeez. That's not fair. <laughs> oh, this... This is... Okay, we're gonna just go down there. I didn't know this was in here. This is awesome. Oh god. Is Steve like the easy mode? I think Steve's like the easy mode or something. Because everybody else had ammo. He does not have any. Let's take the herb. Sure. Uh, where are we going? Let's go this way. Battle mode. I guess this is after three. Three had, um. Oh my god. Three had, uh, mercenaries mode, right? Uh, uh oh. Well, uh, hold on. I think we're okay. For a little bit. Locked. Must be going the right way the whole time then. Ooh. We've gotten the blue herb. Combine that with this. Then let's use it. Oh, I'm still. Fuck, I'm still orange caution. That's crazy. I wonder what the end of this is. 
you can unlock Wesker in this mode? Oh, nice. How do you how do you unlock him? Is it Wesker for this mode, or is it West? You unlock Wesker in this mode for like the main game? Because I I think both those would be cool. You need to beat battle game with Chris. Okay. Interesting. No for this mode for sure. Oh, okay. Can I use this? It's locked. Okay. I don't know. This is kind of dumb. <laughs> I bet you this is a lot harder though if you had to like conserve your ammo. I don't know why you'd use the Lugers if uh like look how look how good these things are. Oh yeah! Let's <laughs> use inventory is some knife and three herbs, really? That's fun. Oh man, that is awesome. That is really good. Anyways, that's Resident Evil Code Veronica X. Thanks for watching. It's been fun. Um, yeah, that was a cool game. Uh, stay sexy, stay beautiful. See you next time. We're going to do Fatal Frame 3, our next big game. We might play something in between because we're going to start this uh, Fatal Frame. Oh no, because if we're starting Fatal Frame 3 this or like tomorrow then never mind we're gonna be going to shit to fatal frame anyways thanks for watching see you later have a good night take care of yourself stay sexy and uh be good to each other bye